Good morning, fellow Ambazonians. Today, na country Sunday. Happy country Sunday for all man way. It pay the price for this our war this Sunday way. This Monday way, all man na shidong for house. All man dan pack moto. Taxi driver they dan pack benzkin they dan pack across Ambazonia for make a sacrifice. And we call a happy country Sunday because say na a good thing time we the plant. Time we the plant seed. You no know, be some time we you the do am. The, the the you need to pay price now time where you walk the walk you need to see any chop you add now another chop on top of your skin so now time for investment investment at time where you sacrifice you sacrifice the hope say the glad say rain you go come for that one seed where you don't plant them it will come out now 100 uh, conway you go come out it will can grow or even a small potatoes leaf you don't plant up the ground you know say you go grow come out you go chop plenty now why that would call them say happy country sunday for all Ambazonia that would plant this seed for our freedom and for independence for our country. So I want to welcome to another episode for our podcast where we would do them every morning, every morning for put out a positive information for our people, uh, a truthful information to our people to bring una analysis where it be based on fact, where it be substantial for where it help our people them as we work out for the good for this journey for our freedom. Because information is power, information is knowledge. So in a wider way, empower una with this knowledge and this information may help we through this journey to our freedom for the independence of Ambazonia. Our good people, I will start today with uh, respond for feedback what they get them from my message was sent them regarding Mangang, the Ambazonian Mama, I call her Mama Ambazonia, where they ran sentence for America for 43 months for prison because say it be the try for help for fight for freedom by sending weapons for Ambazonia. Some people them for ground zero they, they ask me say if they, they catch people for diaspora put them for prison now because of this struggle it means say Napobia it the win it means say like America they need to support we again and they be very worried. So now I want for come for can correct some small misunderstanding because if you put something one way some man go hear them another way. Which I want for tell one and I say the only problem with they put Mangang for prison, not be because say he support Ambazonia, na, but na because say the thing where he do and for support Ambazonia, he violate law them for America. For America, you know if you take weapon, buy gun for America, send them for outside their country, that one a big, big crime. It no matter whether you do one do one for good thing or for bad. So the thing where they punish Mangang, no be say. If we want to help Ambazonia, but now because say each each then carry gun, they allege say then take gun them for America, pass them out of their border. So now the crime that way then commit them. So America in need to do the action now because they support the Republic or they want to try for stop Ambazonia struggle. They simply implement like their local law. A lot of American them where Amer Ambazonia do they for America, they see support Ambazonia struggle openly. They need to hide them. What would they do fundraising? When I see American, they come, they, they campaign publicly. Plenty of American and Bazunian, they, they can campaign more, raise money. And no American government, in nobody go charge their house, in nobody carry investigation for them because they, they do not the right thing. American po foreign policy, it is support self determination. So by default, it is support Ambazonia. America, they are even enemy for poor beer for this war because they don't sanction the Republic to Cameroon against for move them for some. Treat you where they be there for the way they help the media they say they think they're for America without paying tax. So make our people they no feel say this thing it means at the end of the day. But it is show we say Ambazonia then be ready for even broke law for our side for try for help we even put their life at risk so they go for prison because they want for fight for our freedom. So now they think that what I want to make our people then know. Say this one not be victory for La Republic to Cameroon. Yes, it is pain we because our own mama we he the one do everything say me save it, picking them mangang he don't try for enter for hell we fall for this type of problem we need for learn say as we want try for buy weapon them for defend our people them for defend our villages them maybe we must do them within the bounds of international law because if we make the wrong way it go instead take move people them for struggle because the time mangang we go there for prison you know go feed do the thing the way we do them for support we the way we be the do them i remember the woman the way they support them for idp them right from nigeria right inside ground one uh, gra ground zero woman where they stay for for bush now be big loss for them for the thing the way mangang be used to send up for them but we know say it will turn out for be good 
because he doesn't stand for see support ambazonia he nobody leave struggle because then catch you for this thing we don't do him. but he is stand the campaign for we so make we know say this struggle will be so important we are people that will be ready for for do everything so that make we win so fellow ambazonians the message why they bring them for una today now because say i want for strengthen una our people they always know say we for ambazonia will do something now because say hey i like the man hey i don't like the man and i want for sick i go continue for hit this message i go hit them very very strongly because i've been at the chief spokesman for ambazonia now me i be the man where i don't show na hope time way the days will be very dark and i must be very honest with una because i believe say honesty now if he lead with a place where we will take our freedom right now as i be tell una all the thing we are the calculator and we go in front now say now how we will win are we winning are we heading to boya or not if we are not heading to boya we reassess them see what i will be taking at the wrong road if we will be taking at the wrong road so man discover and say the road will go then go come back for that same place we'll start then when one go in front now how we will take now which different road again or now how we will look so now they think that what they do and for now and now they think that what they for they now so I go tell una very clean and clearly, without any fear, so that make una know the truth. My calculation, na say we go get our independence, when at the international community it go come push like the public me grant with that independence. And right now, I feel say we don't lose the support for the international community the way we be before, because before no matter how we fight and no matter which way they talk for our side. The international community at the end of the day they did can't stand the push and say there must be negotiation for solve this problem they always come back because they support we they sympathize with we because of the thing with the republic it did one for we right now i believe so we don't lost that sympathy for the international community and with the way way things that they go if we not change that perception for the international community then we go lose this war and if we lose this war we will be worse than which we will be now because the example I go give for now, now the Republic, that way they be defied their own Ambazonian, their own um, uh, Cameroon liberation. That means the war for um, uh, Cameroon independence after they don't get independence. Maybe we know say they be start fight their own war, the Marquesa war. Now after they be done get independence because they be no saying a fake independence. Then fight the war very much. Then born Douala. That way NS1 they be born Douala. The French government they, their skin they be shake. Then come for come make an offer for them. Then talk say, me will try to solve the problem. We will bring na um your bed them, NS1 in them. Me then can't stand for before. We will give them some small, small fake independence. Them. The NS1 in them, at that moment, they reject them completely. Say, we want a total independence. The mistake where they be make them, na say, wait, one, when they be reject this, this uh, offer from the French government, they no be transmit their reasons they not be convinced the other international partners the way they begin them about their thinking because the africans them they will not say once we be right we must win we will do the go before they need to for assess them and then reassure the international partner and say they know which way they do and they know the bargaining power where they do them because for the war and give and take when i see even ukraine when they lose war against russia they become say the one can't for negotiate the one can't with russia them talk because they aim for Ukraine for Shidong with Russia for talk. Now for, for Kaju, the international community, me then give them weapon, me then fight Russia. So the president for Ukraine will not say for he had. He no one give one meta for their land for Russia. But that way he say America them, the rest of the world, they go support you the way they go support them. Me they support be way they go win. He go start beginning the softening him up, the softening him up. Go back, go talk even with Russia. When he talk with Russia, he go, the Russia go show say, now they know one piece because russia one only take their land and then when russia is shows it they the only one take their land they know one piece the ukrainian it will go back for america say uh-huh will we'll not support me so we ambazonia we need to be very smart for know the time way we will stand for the war the challenge la republic too strongly and the time will come for sure for the war say suffering suffering now so one na, na, na peace we will now not be say peace we want justice but we want to be reasonable. There is time where you must soften your word. You must casual the international community. Now, why that way I become out can talk say I congratulate Paul Bia. Not be because of Paul Bia, na man will feel congratulated. 
na sense what they do um, as my name na sense past king for can show you say hey that ambazonia the way he be feel say they hate you so much them two them be tolerant they feel listen for you and even when we look at it capture the whole international press even like the public them newspaper the way na francophone they read and way you nobody ever talk about we them put my face for front if we do it it this ampobia if you look the debate for la republic all the table it be turned say pobia it must negotiate when la republic they get pressure for negotiate it means say ambazonia they win when there is no pressure say me la republic it negotiate ambazonia they lost but if the time done reach like now we will not get that pressure say me la republic it negotiate then next year i go send one some information about some plain way the the israelite government where they advise la republic have a fight the war they be done talk say for them for already get military success they need for buy that plane they be done pay money for that plane already 25 million the italian government them they don't pens that plane already with cameroon flag but they never deliver them for for la republic because they don't want to try for to twist things them so that we will get advantage for win the war because they already support we because they see we so they know so will be right with the fight for a just cost but we don't already mess up the chances they will get them so right now na la republic they the get their the advantage and they try all things what they do them including my res resignation now for force our leadership especially dr chua no say na he be the the primary person where the world is here and say na he the lead our struggle make it get a reconsideration of where things are because if the position would the, would the push up aside and say would the win at the time we will need the win we never even realize and say now so things that they worry at the top for one man way i be in touch with ground zero my finger then they for all corner there is nobody in ambazonia who is connected to the ground like me there is nobody that can assess our capability because i've been at the chief ambazonia propaganda and he used positive propaganda for push our struggle before only my propaganda it make a republic the panic i go give you this example not be said the one deconstruct ambazonia our propaganda but now because our make will not come to reality so that together we will win this war now the only purpose i know say people they will always twist with they talking about i don't care because i care for our life them and our victory more than every other thing we are care for i don't tell when i say we don't attack for inside chair street two times this past two day them as a matter of fact that attack na me a carry am using propaganda only for social media because i don't intimidate like republic their their soldier they they didn't know say we will, will strong pass the way we will day because now the thing that we propaganda they do one for make me will be strong pass the whole day i don't be forced for talk this thing them publicly so because i don't try for talk and privately for the past three months for push them in about work now why that they can't tell now and i must tell i must, I must talk and save this struggle I don't tell when I say we don't attack La Republic for Chia Street. They pass two days them. When I run here shooting way there for Bamenda. Those shooting them now because of the propaganda we make up the area, the Duam, using our real forces them for ground zero. Because I know their capability. If I frighten La Republic only for frightening them, then since they go turn the shoot gun amongst themselves, they run, run up and down. Because they don't know who's how they come. Because of the way we are putting them. Those propaganda are not baseless because we have real forces on the ground with heavy machine where they fight our, 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 our war very well. But when you, you lose, you need to realize. Only the, the loss who lost them for inside uh, Taman Feng, for, for, for Man Kondé, for Bamenda, where they, they seize one of our chain cutter with four AK-47 AK them. I mean, real Ambazonia fighter, they don't, we don't lost them. Transporter, we don't lost them during these few, few times. Them. So if some man feels say would they in a position where they win? No, we are not. But if we reverse this this uh, winning way, like if we reverse this loss, we will lose some. We are not winning right now as a fit owner, and we must be capable for acknowledge that one, and are pushing for for public because privately and within leadership, we don't begin to believe our own propaganda. They take them like for reality. If in our own private conversations, them now I put them for public because say, I, 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 I take drastic measure them for for save this struggle. If we believe our own propaganda in the terms of leadership, then we are going nowhere. I will tell another one. I will be very honest with you now. We need to realize and say when would we win? Not be just so we win militarily, because La Republic, if we key all Ambazonian soldier them, but so long as we we'll be capable for maintain the international pressure for La Republic. For bring justice for our country then we are winning so our winning 
it be reliance on two fronts our capability on ground zero and our ability to recruit train arm and deploy soldier coupled with international pressure that leans towards ambazonia this tool now balance them for scale for justice for ambazonia that means they will get capability for recruit and build soldiers and arm them and send them to battle and then our ability to use those soldiers on the ground to force the international community to come to pressure Cameroon to give us what we want then we are winning but when we have losses that are going on on the ground and then at the same time we are losing the international support we must sit down take some time and refocus how we are going are we going the right way or we are going the wrong way we must we must i repeat listen to me and listen to me carefully send a clear signal to the international community that will cajou them to start talking about negotiation back with the republic because my country people as i'm telling you people right now it is not happening not the american government is asking for pressure from la republic not the not the canadian government is putting pressure to la republic absolutely nobody as a matter of fact they are instead engaging la republic to cameroon to 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 see how they can now even just go along with the, with the things the way they are because cameroon is going through transition they know that their president will die they are forced them to come to 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 the negotiation table during this period so that they can see how they can they can help ambazonia using this this small chance that they have now we have lost those chance we must send an indication to the international community that would turn the tide against la republic otherwise they lose the loss we are having on the ground will not be able to be compensated with diplomatic victory these two things are very crucial how do we go forward we must i repeat we must convince and send an international message to convince the international community to start putting pressure back on la republic or to start thinking about a way to peace that will come through justice for ambazonia and not a way for peace that will mean that they have given cameroon a chance to do whatever they want to do with us i i will push for signals along that line that is meant to cajou the international community because i believe as i'm telling you people today our all ambazonian movements have been transformed into political parties already in their thinking they have failed to take the right decisions that i was expecting and the indications that i was monitoring the the leaderships and to see what they will react and their thinking have they come to make assessment is that everybody thinks that those people anyway they think that what i'm doing is because i'm angry capo daniel is so angry that i've become emotional of course i'm angry of course i'm emotional we are human beings but those anger and emotions should not override our rational thinking when it comes to the survival of the people so everything i put out there is measured there is poss possibility that la republic will always use what we put out for propaganda but what i care the most is to make us to come to our realization that our posture have to change otherwise we are heading towards a defeat our posture have to change otherwise we are heading to defeat do we have the capability to send signal to the international community yes are we sending the right signal to the international community right now no are we capable of changing things that will favor us yes everybody in ground zero can see the signs of what i'm saying except those who are who have lost touch of ground zero I'm not saying that I'm speaking against the diaspora because you can be in the diaspora and you actually have more information about Ground Zero than people who are there. Because somebody can be in Bamenda, he doesn't know what is happening in Bui. You can actually be in America, you know what is happening in Bui more than somebody who is in Bamenda. Because by the way, both of you are receiving information the same way. So, desperate moments require desperate actions. Desperate moves. I am going to take drastic decision as a leader of ambazonia to turn around the international momentum for ambazonia i'm calling on our soldiers on the ground to adapt more right now to gorilla warfare tactics
secured guerrilla warfare with a combination of uh, a community approach and a popular approach on the ground as well. I will be telling you people why in my messages subsequently on the military front and why next year, not even next year, by the by the mid of this, uh, probably by June, we should have adapt. We, we should have adopted uh, very professional guerrilla approach to our liberation front on Ground Zero. We should also adapt adopt ourselves to fight against CDC and all those plantations. And I'm very very happy with the reception I've had with the forces in um, in Dian in particular, the forces in, uh, in 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 Fako, and in many other places. It, it's just been fantastic the reception I've had with them because they are the ones who are really feeling the pause. And uh, th those feedbacks are very good. So I want to tell Ambazonian people that do not feel discouraged or feel disheartening if you hear this message. It's just that sometimes you have to, to, to face reality so that you can take the right decisions. You have to face that reality that this is what I face. How do I change this situation to favor me? And then you take the right decisions to do it. For the meantime, I will ask our people to continue to uphold the lockdown, the, the ghost town, every Monday. I will ask our forces to take more measures to secure themselves and their materials and to attack the enemy with pure guerrilla tactics as they have been doing. Carry out IED attacks. Make sure that the technology that we have that was also not going, was not also being distributed because of, this problem is not only with the political leadership. In Ground Zero, people have technology and they don't share those technology also. They hold it like leverage over other groups. So our forces on the ground, they have to stop those nonsense. Those barriers that make them unable to share weapons, share guns, share technology. They have to stop it. Because for us to win this war, they will need to be able to move from one camp to another, have refuge in one place or another and strategize on how to best liberate our home. I've put out this very sensitive information out there because it is a collective struggle and i need our people to be able to know why certain posture have to change and what it is meant to accomplish so that the enemy will not twist it definitely they will cut part of this audio and and try to misrepresent it but i believe that for us to be able to win we must have that ability to overcome those manipulation there are always people who are going to go out there to manipulate what i say or try to twist it but you know very sure where my heart is and what I'm, why I'm doing the things I'm doing. So God bless you all. Let us stay focused. Let us fight. To all of our soldiers, adjust your, your posture to pure guerrilla warfare, warfare, knowing very much, knowing very well that we are in a desperate time. We are indeed in a desperate time and we must take very drastic uh, measures to protect ourselves and to liberate our homeland. Give the enemy hell. Attack them when they least expect. Attack them. And we'll continue to do what we have to do to maintain the momentum and to turn the tide against the enemy. It's very important. So once more, before I, I finish, I'll tell you one of these because I know this particular part will be very controversial. Where well, I don't talk about my propaganda and our propaganda on, the, on Ground Zero. The reason I do that, the reason I put this very sensitive information outside there is to do one thing. To show our people that we should not just think that we can just be going the way we are going and we are going to win la republic because the way we are going right now if we just continue to be going like that brrr, we are heading to a defeat right now as i'm telling you people we must change something and i've proposed to you people and i've told you people what i believe we should change and i will take the responsibility to make those changes and i hope other leaders will come to their realization to do the same and to follow those changes and our soldiers on the ground be strong adjust yourself because days are bad everybody should embrace the liberation tax in a moderate manner that is sustainable and that will not change our our trajectory especially like in vekovi what is happening in vekovi it is excessive be proportional be reasonable. Do not be excessive in whatever you do and we will win. We will win just fine. But right now, we must do certain things to focus, to, to, to rejuvenate and to regain the international momentum, which is very crucial. Because whatever we are doing in Ground Zero, 
whatever we are doing in ground zero it can only matter it can only be useful if it affects the diplomatic end if it does not reinforce or help the diplomatic front then whatever we are doing will not will just be wasting people's life will just be wasting people's life and that is my calculation that is my belief and that is what i'm going to push the reason i had come out I'll, I'll say it again the reason i mentioned about our capacity on the ground and our propaganda on the ground is just to demonstrate to you that i know what i'm talking about because i'm the master in what i do i'm the best propaganda that propagandist that you have and you need propaganda in war propaganda is more lethal than 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 fighting so my propaganda that I do for Ambazonia is more damaging to La Republic du Cameroon than even our real actions on the ground. But we need that real actions on the ground. We do those real actions on the ground. We build those capacity because without those real actions and those real capability, then the propaganda is useless. So everybody, not, not, don't be worried that I've put out those things, but be sure that we have the capacity on the ground and we can do the things that I say and we will continue to do it. But it's very important that we change trajectory to make sure that we are on a winning streak because I believe we can do it and we will do it. We will do it. I will personally make sure that it happens and that is exactly what I'm doing now. It is inconvenient. It is not comfortable because I've been forced to get to a position where I have to do it collectively because it cannot be done privately. So this is a series of messages I've been putting out there so that we'll get to where we need to get so that we can finish this war and make sure that our people can have the freedom and independence that we long for. God bless you all. Capo Daniel, signing off.